Well, hello guys, and welcome to Jadelina's Tubor Nursery. Here I am with a nursery tour, let's say. Um, I just wanted to show what I did, guys. I put my babies in a shelf with glass doors, and I'm really happy with the result. Let me show you. I have the crib here because I just thought, you know, I would like to have one baby at the time i'm sorry displayed and i have Jaden. um so um you know with this option i can display one baby at the time and enjoy just one baby and as you know i still I i'm sorry my alarm uh just stopped my video i'm in my Jaden obsession still so <laughs> he's the one that is here but as you can see i have two babies there let me see if you can see let me open it because of the reflection you cannot see um so i have jonathan and jordan there um i think i could fit one baby more there but i really want to <laughs> make it simple i don't want to make it complicated um, Jania, my first reborn, and Jalani, Sophia, which is my Laura that I need to root. My beautiful, beautiful journey that looks amazing there. I love her. She's my masterpiece of all my collection. I love her so much. Um, Jolina Grace, which is in her tummy, and... I have her, and you can see the back, the plastic, the plastic there. Well, it was not so perfect as I thought, you know. And there is Jeremiah that needs to be rooted. Is the cuddle baby Jeremiah? So uh, let me let me start again. You know, Jonathan was painted by me. He's the corny sculpt by Bonnefou Baby. Um, he needs to be rooted. <laughs> Of course, as all my personal babies, they are not the priority, but I promise I'm going to do it. Jordan was painted by Mrs. Serenity Smith. His sculpt is Junis by Sabina Turkic. Jania is the Lavender by Bonneville Baby, painted by, oh my gosh, Berry Bundles. She's not longer reborning. Um, I was yesterday talking that this baby sailor is just she has like a mixture of satin because she's always when she arrived was a little bit more you know when you see her in the light she's a little bit shiny but she was the most handled baby in my collection i changed her like three or four times a day for the first year and then like two times or maybe once the second year so she and she doesn't lose anything. She was perfectly sealed. Um, so I'm jealous. She's just amazing. And this is Laura by Bonnie, Bonnie Brown. And I painted her. And I need to root her. Um, and she has a satin finish. Because she was sealed by, with uh, Beatrice Clemente's sealer. Which is nice, but I didn't have the texture that I have with Jonathan. That was with Genesis heat set paints. Um, Journey, my beautiful, oh my goodness, mommy. And the beautiful nose. She is the precious sculpt by Lori Sullivan Roy. And she was painted by Cheryl Martin. Amazing artist. Amazing human being. Um... Angelina is the my sculpt by Marta Glatzak. She sculpted, poured, and painted and brewed the baby. She did everything. She's an amazing baby. I love her sculpting, her proportions. She's just beautiful. And this is the cuddle baby, Jeremiah, which is the vada sculpt by um kathy romero biscuiti and she he was painted by missy serenity smith he could be a boy or girl um when he has the hair or she 
I will put both genders and see which one looks better. But he's a cuddle baby, completely cuddle. He doesn't ha have a hands and feet. Um, and there is a working baby that I'm going to show you my next video. I'm going to show my last baby that I finished rooting and he's done, he's dressed. I'm going to make the details video of that baby. So I think it works for me to have that empty because there I can put the babies I'm working on. Um, when I am making babies, I put the body together and I like to have like all the body weighted. And when I finish rooting, I just weight only the head. That's the way I usually do. Um, and I really enjoy it because there I can, you know, stay by step, see if they're waiting. I really like the waiting. So sometimes you wait the baby and spending time with the baby, you see that it needs a little bit more of this or that or less. So I like to wait my babies um, right away after they are sealed. But not the head because it's going to be rooted. So that's my collection right now as it is. Um, I need to root these babies. He's one of the, well, the cuddle baby will be first. I'm going to root him after this one that I finished. But I think he's the other one that I'm going to root. So maybe it could be available. I don't know because with hair, everything changed. <laughs> And she's my personal baby. I will not sell her because I sold my other Laura. And I don't want to do that again. I want to have a Laura in my collection. And that baby too, I have to root. So I, I have to take time for my personal babies. Because I haven't taken any time for them. I just, for the older babies, so doesn't have time for them. So that way, I think it's wonderful because they do not collect dust and they are comfortable they don't have anything that in case of the silicone you know something that can um i don't know make any any anything to the silicone you know the closed doors anything can enter here that's, that's something that i really wanted um look at my girl after one year she's just exactly how i purchased her i love her um i love those leaves i love full leaves with my babies anyways guys just wanted to show that so if you close the doors you can see my reflection so i i need to to change these knobs because this shelf actually was from my son my son have that to he's a bookshelf you know he has this bookshelf so what i did i switch with him because i have my babies in a ikea like a model model is that the name that um i can have the display and i really like it but they collect dust so with glass doors i feel more comfortable and having the crib here is nice because I can switch my babies. So, oh, another baby in my collection is Jaden. Jaden is the Everett sculpt by Dot Madley Madliot, and he was painted and rooted by Mrs. Serenity Smith. Isn't he beautiful? I love this baby so so much. I'm crazy about him. Um, what is, I was saying is that. Um, that shelf was from my my son. My son wanted me. Um, I told him my idea, what I want to do, and he was like, "Okay, no problem." So he removed all his books, and just was hilarious. He made me do this yesterday. It was not the plan. I wanted to do this with more time, but again, he wanted to do it. Um, so I switched with him the shelf that I have for this one so I didn't have to invest I thought on that you know I don't want to invest more money I want to work it out with what I have I don't want to keep buying because I have too much stuff if I keep buying I will have much more stuff 
so I thought on this idea and it worked it out so I'm very very happy to share that with you guys and I hope you like it give me your feedback <laughs> on this when I begin in my collecting having babies in a shelf was not part of the you know of the of the idea of having babies because I thought you know it's not realistic to have the babies display in a shelf i want my babies in baby items you know a crib a bouncer a baby seat whatever but when my collection start growing more i just couldn't handle it so <laughs> it's my way to feel that everything is organized and that everything is protected and that they look good so this is was my my solution to the problem so uh, and that's the, the, the thing that we collectors keep changing our taste on everything. My gosh. So I will stop saying I don't like this. I don't like that because I will end up doing <laughs> some of that. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for your time. I will show you my baby in the next video. So stay tuned um, for you to see my last job. And I hope you like my nursery as it is now now so uh, see you until the next video guys and thank you so much for watching and to stay until this part bye bye